Hey, this is Randy Milker with uh, CuresAndRemedies.net. Today I'll be answering the question, why does the yeast infection keep coming back? Why is it recurring? Um, uh, there's a deep-rooted form of the fungus, of Candida albicans, and, and once it has deep roots, and once it's into your body, it is very difficult to eradicate out of your body. Um, even if you put uh, topical creams on it, for instance, if it's on your hands or in your mouth, wherever, you're, you can put the antifungal cream on it, um, it's still very difficult to get rid of if, in fact, you have, uh, if, it, if it has deep roots going down uh, underneath the skin. The topical, uh, topical stuff that you put on may, in fact, not get down and actually kill the roots of the system. Uh, what needs to, to happen is you need to attack it more with a systemic approach. You need to make sure that um, you are not giving um, that mold colony, uh, which is what it is, um, the conditions that it needs to survive, the right food to be able to eat. So it may in fact entail a change of lifestyle, a change of what you're feeding your body, because that may in fact be what is uh, allowing this yeast, inf yeast infection to uh, multiply and thrive where it is. Uh, sometimes topical, topical treatment uh, may not quite be enough. Uh, you're gonna have to deal with the root cause of the problem. Um, now, if you're dealing with uh, some type of a yeast infection, um, you're not alone. Um, at some time in their life, 75% of the population is going to have some type of a yeast infection. Um, yeast infections have been around through all of human history, and people have been treating it with natural remedies uh, throughout all of human history as well, um, with success, I might add. So, uh, if you are fed up uh, and ready to be finished with the pain and hassle of any type of a severe or recurring yeast infection, uh, you can have dramatic relief within 12 hours. Uh, go to the link that you see below um, to get the yeast infection program that actually deals with the root causes of the yeast infection as opposed to just masking over the symptoms of the yeast infection and potentially even setting you up for a reoccurrence or a relapse of that yeast infection. All right, thanks.